Right, now that we've gone ahead and run our trial for uh, about 15 minutes or so, let's go ahead and test it. All right, we begin first by shutting off the pump. So I'm gonna be screwing in the screw here. You can see that gas stops, all right? Disconnect up here, makes it easier, less floppy. Here we go, pull this out here, all right? So all that's left to do now is to go ahead and titrate this back to our gray-green or green color, depending on which one we started with. All right, I have my syringe at 10 mils. That way it's very easy to tell how many mils were used when we do our math afterwards. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and add a drop at a time. A couple there, turn there. Drop, drop, turn, all right, drop, all right. So we're adding a drop and we're swirling in between each of the times. So you start to see that the color now is becoming a little more kind of charcoaly colored. It's definitely lighter, not quite the bright pink we had before. So getting close to that transition period. Right. A little bit more kind of a watery color. Even more kind of a charcoaly color. You can see it against the white there, but not quite to the green. All right, get a more drop there. From there. So we, now we're definitely to kind of a gray color. No more kind of a charcoaly pink color, but not kind of like a charcoaly. Well, just more of a gray, uh, dark gray green kind of color. That. But since I started from the green, I'm going to do one more drop. There we go. And turn that. And you can see the gray went right to the green. So that's our endpoint. So now what we do is we look at our syringe. There we go. And from the 10 mil mark, uh, I finished, it took me basically um, one mil to go ahead and, so from the 10 to the nine, that's gonna be one mil, to go ahead and make that change. Well, it's a bit easier off the top of my head. And since uh, the multiplier is how many mils you wind up using times 16 is how many uh, PPM of free SO2 we're in that wine sample. So since it was one mil, uh, that's pretty straightforward. Uh, that's basically there was 16 ppm free in that wine sample. And that's pretty much it. That's the test.